Hi guys, it's a good evening from Mercia, Negros, Occidental Philippines. And it's blackout, brownout. Right guys, so we're actually here at my girlfriend's mama's. Um, it's been blackout for quite a while now. So, you know, it's something you get used to. Well, not exactly used to. So what we're doing really is just sat there looking on the phones and we're getting ready to go into town because there's nothing to do with it being brown out right so we actually do set off up into town as you can see and it'll come apparent later on in the video you'll actually see why there's a brown out a blackout so it looks like Mercia is actually getting ready for for the festival coming soon it's all saints day today so we had to actually go into mercia so it's you know not far now guys for christmas and a lot of you guys are actually coming to the philippines round about now actually it's going to be very expensive after this month to come to the philippines guys very expensive so we're looking around town and because it's an holiday a lot of the bread's being sold, you know, so we have a little walk around. I'm stood here actually doing video and a guy tells me to stop filming and I said, no, it's a public place and it's not it, actually nothing really to, you know, it's not really hurting him. First time I've ever been told to stop filming, so I don't know why. Anyway, so we're here in Mercia town. And we have a little walk around. Not a lot to do really because a lot of the places close very early with it being All Saints Day. So, you know, a lot of the places are closed. And, you know, because the brown out, we just had a little walk up into Mercia. And it's a little bit late actually to do a shopping. You know, I mean, a lot of the shops are closed. A lot of the shops closed at five o'clock. Now, gambling, if you like your gambling, is the place. So, Mercy is getting ready for its festival very, very soon. And you'll see the big wheel soon. We're coming up to the big wheel. Here we are, look. In fact, the guy's up the big wheel and it looks like he's fixing it getting it ready so i think now today it'll actually i think we're on saturday you know i think i think this baby will probably be running saturday and sunday you know this is the day after now guys i'm home so that's it look the ferris wheel the big wheel so you know quite a lot of friendly people around to say hi to hello and I was I was going to have a walk through the market, through the fish market, but I actually I'm study waiting as you can see. I'm actually waiting for Joveline. She's in the fish market. Here's the fish market at the other side. This this lady's waving, she says hello, I said hello hi. He got a little bit too close, I don't know what he was playing at. So he might just be looking for food. So we're actually going to walk back down, back down the hill and we're going to walk back down to Joveline's mama's. It actually rained guys and it actually, it actually threw it down very, very heavy rain. Now this is the problem, this is the blackout. So brown out is a lot of you call it. I can guess why the war, you know, I'm sure that came from the war. Right, so he's up the pole, look, the guy's up the pole, and he's fixing the electric. Now, this electric's been off for, wow, hours and hours and hours and hours. Half of the, most of the afternoon and into the night. So it's been off a long time. So it looks like they found the fault, and it was a relay box, so we was told. But the guys up there were big bolt cutters. With big rubber angles on, yeah, for the electric, we know. So he's up there, look, fixing the wire. And the bad thing about it, five minutes ago, it absolutely chucking it down with very, very heavy rain. So, you know, that's what he's doing. 
it's fixing the wires. So I got a few little short videos of this guy and his crew and you'll see they're flashing the torches up so you can see. So that's how they do it here look in the Philippines. They just flash a torch up there. You know the guy hasn't got an head, he's got no torch on his helmet. You know, they just go up the ladder, they've got no torches. In this day and age, you know, you'd think he'd have a torch strapped to his helmet so he can see. You know, to keep him safe. See, looks like he's been cutting some wires and rejoining them. But we got told it was the relay box. So, like I said, come on guys, why, why isn't this guy, right, he's up there playing with electrical wires and a relay box. And he's, he's got no torch on his helmet. You know, he's passing the bolt cutters down. So, how much is a torch? Wow. So, keep safe, that's all I can say. So, you know, little short video is coming down the ladder now. So, you know, we, when I got down to the girlfriend's mama's, the electric came on absolutely fantastic. Please like and support. Please like, please subscribe, please share the videos. Please help support.